Saturdays. Welcome to our behind the scenes of our photo shoot. Hey, I'm Molly from Saturdays. We've been doing a reality TV show over in America. People will get to know us completely inside out, which I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, so I have to leave you to decide that. Hi, it's Una from the Saturdays. Basically, it's a reality show following our lives in the attempt to break the American market. Hey, I'm Vanessa and I'm from the Saturdays. The shoot today was so much fun. I'm loving my outfit and yeah, fun poses. Hey, I'm Rochelle from the Saturdays. The most stylish in the band is me. I'm joking. <laughs> I actually really love each girl's style for different reasons. Everyone dresses really differently, so there's bits of them that I would like to wear and steal for the day. That's a tough question to ask who's the most stylish, because I'll probably offend them all, because they all probably think they're the most stylish, so I'll just have to stay myself, even though I'm definitely not. The best tattoos, um, probably Vanessa. The girl with the best tattoos is definitely Vanessa. I think Vanessa's got some amazing tattoos, things that I wouldn't have the guts to do. I really like my tattoos, obviously, and I'm sure everyone else loves their tattoos, otherwise I wouldn't have got it done. My girl crush would definitely be Nicole Richie. I just love her style so much. My girl crush at the minute is Blake Lively. A little bit jealous of how she looks with no makeup on, if I'm honest. Megan Fox, because she just always looks hot. They always change, but at the moment, it's Girls Aloud, all of them, in their new video. There's so much hair flipping around, the wind machine. Oh my God, I need to, I practice that with my hair dryer. Oh, the most flirtatious in the group is definitely Frankie, and she knows that. Frankie Sanford is the most flirtiest. Flirtiest? Is that even a word? I don't know, but she is that. My signature dance move usually involves my long arms in the air. All the girls laugh at me when I do this move because like, it took me forever to learn it. And then once I had it, I busted out every night on a month's dance floor. It's just the hip, dip, that one. The girls say that when I'm dancing, like I always look at my ass. I'm really embarrassed to say. Hey, that apparently that's what I do. It's really geeky, it's just a hand point, but my secret move that not many people know I can do is the Michael Jackson moonwalk, which I can do, I promise. The person that takes the longest to get ready is Molly. 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 Molly definitely takes the longest to get ready. Everyone I know will have said I take the longest to get ready. So not true, a little bit. My bad habits are the fact that I have quite a foul mouth and the girls hate it when I drop the sea bomb <laughs> If I wasn't in the Saturdays, I really don't know what I'd be doing because I did try a few things before I joined the Saturdays. I was I tried primary school teaching, nursing, I was a medical secretary, a lifeguard. I also would love to be an interior designer. I love that. I worked in a restaurant, I worked behind a bar, I worked in a bank. Oh, if I had to choose something completely different, it would probably be working with animals, that kind of thing. I just love animals. I've tried it all before, so God knows what I'd be doing. So fans that want to follow in our footsteps, I would say never give up. Do not stop. You know, just put loads of hard work in. And if anyone just tells you no, just keep going at it. It takes so much determination. So just go for it. Follow your dreams.